what is really good we are back with a pokemon ultra sun and ultra moon wi-fi battle happy friday everybody it's the weekend coming up what are you guys doing i'm gonna be getting to the money i never sleep because while i'm sleeping the money's out there not sleeping and if i'm sleeping i can't get to the money you know <laughs> i don't know what i'm talking about anyways got a wi-fi battle here that's probably what i should be talking about uh I have a, uh, what is it, Slurpuff? I have a Slurpuff on my team. I don't know how this happened, okay? I don't even like Slurpuff. But because Slurpuff actually gets sticky web now, it's useful sometimes. <laughs> I don't really care for Slurpuff at all. Like, a lot of fairy types are just, they, they just don't fit my fancy. I, I don't I don't fuck with Slurpuff. But he does get sticky web and he gets magic coat. So I'm gonna go for the magic coat right now because I think the will o -Wisp is pretty obvious. Uh, and he ends up burning himself. <laughs> You fool! You can't burn me! Uh, but anyways, I don't think he's gonna go for Willis again, so I'm gonna go for the Sticky Web now, uh, as he goes for the Volt Switch, which was, you know, I think I got the mind game successful there. Uh, I knew he wouldn't go for Willis again, so I just decided to go for the Sticky Web as he goes for Volt Switch. I think I did exactly what I wanted to do there. I avoided getting burned, which is perfect for me, because, uh, I mean, I don't have any physical attacks on this thing. I'm actually a special attacker. Uh, but anyways, he's gonna Volt Switch out to his Magirna, I'm not about to sit around and get flash cannons or anything like that, so I'm actually going to go out to my Chandelure. And this Chandelure is max special attack, choice specs, modest. So basically, if you look at his team, you know damn well, anything that switches in is getting hit extremely hard. And obviously he's going to switch out because I am a fire type, and I could easily kill him with a fire move. He's gonna go out to his Heatran thing, and I'm gonna go for the fire move, but I didn't go for the fire move. I went for the Shadow Ball, which is super strong because I'm Choice Specs, Modest, and Max Special Attack. And he's gonna take like 90% from this Shadow Ball. We ain't playing no games around here, boy. I got the heavy hitters. I'm out here, hitting powerful, hitting strong, all right? So I'm gonna switch out because, you know, just in case he um, actually wants to stay in and go for Earth Power or anything like that, my Chandelure, uh, was not that fast. I didn't want him to call my bluff and uh, earth power me or anything like that So I'm actually gonna go out to my Slurpuff, which is fine for me because he actually goes out to his low punny If he wants the mega evolve, that's fine. I don't really need Slurpuff anymore at this point uh, So he's gonna mega evolve and I'm really thrown off here I, I think he didn't raise the happiness on his low punny because he goes for return and it basically does nothing and I'm able to get off a huge hit with Dazzling Gleam. Now, I don't know for a fact if I was actually able to take that return. I don't know what EVs I have on this uh, Slurpuff here. I just grabbed the team and used it, honestly, <laughs> if we being real here. But either way, I was surprised to see that I lived that. Uh, <laughs> anyways, I'm going to go out to my Blast Toys because I always keep a 9. That's how I blast with the toys, okay? And he's going to switch out. I'm going to Mega Evolve and go for Water Pulse because I wanted to see if I could catch this Rotom and maybe confuse it. Uh, maybe I should have gone for Dark Pulse just because it does more damage. Um, but all of, you know, all of his pulsing moves do extra damage. That's his whole, that's his whole spiel. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so the Water Pulse does a decent amount. Doesn't get the confusion or anything like that. But next turn, I'm gonna go for the Dark Pulse. Whip out my Arm Cannons real quick. Shake him up a little bit. All right, I'm gonna hit him with the Dark Pulse, and he's gonna flinch. And I like that. Because now I don't have to get burned. Now I don't have to get hit with a Volt Switch. Let's go. I take those every time. Now he can't defog. I'm pretty sure he actually brought this thing into maybe defog. Get the sticky web out of there. Um, but since I actually flinched him. <laughs> since I flinched him. The sticky web's there forever now. He actually cannot remove the sticky web from the field. So this is going to make sweeping him so much easier. So, you know, I'm not going to complain about any of that. Uh, but he's going to bring in his Magirna here. I'm just going to stay in because why not? I'm going to go for the Water Pulse, try to get some damage on this thing. I'm sure he has uh, an Assault Vest or something because uh, my Water Pulse didn't do any damage at all. And then his Volt Switch is going to do quite a bit. I didn't expect it to do over half like that. Was that over half? Yeah, that's definitely over half. <laughs> it did a little bit more than half. Uh, he's going to go out to his Lando. Wasn't quite sure what he wanted to do here. Um, but then again, I don't know his set. Maybe he has max max uh, attack on this Lando and knows that Earthquake will kill me uh, Because that's exactly what he does. He goes for the Earthquake and I die. So this is definitely a max attack Lando. Maybe it's Scar um, But the fact that it's max attack means that uh, You know, it's not gonna be able to take hits too well So I'm actually gonna go out to my Volcanion here 
I'm gonna go for the steam eruption just to see if I can catch something slipping. Maybe he wants to go out to his Magirna. Uh, but I doubt he would just because I'm a fire type. So if he did bring in his Magirna, it would have, you know, definitely taken a lot of damage. Uh, but now he's gonna go out to his Weavile. Pretty weird switching on my, you know, in my opinion. Uh, just because it's like, why? Like, <laughs> I outsped your Landers. So obviously, I'm Scarf. Um, but I'm gonna switch out anyways. I'm gonna go to my pre-marina just because I think I can take a hit or two. And he's actually gonna give me the answer to my question of why he switched in Weavile. He went for knockoff, trying to knock off my choice scarf. That makes perfect sense. And in the process, he does 60% to me. Jesus. But obviously he has to switch out because he's not gonna be able to do that same amount of damage to me because I'm not holding an item anymore. And when you're holding an item, knockoff does extra damage. Um, so I'm gonna go for the moon blast. I, I guess I expected him to stay in there. Uh, and I really wouldn't have been able to kill him because my choice specs were gone, so I just decided to go for Moonblast. Uh, now I'm going to go for the Scald, just trying to get a burn or something. It doesn't really matter at this point, though, because at, from, from this point on, I should be able to just kill everything in one hit with Earthquake uh, now that he is sticky webbed up and nothing that he has is off the ground. So, uh, And I don't think any of his Pokemon resist ground as well. So Mamoswine's literally going to be able to come out here and just click Earthquake and sweep his entire team from this point on. So because I quite literally just click Earthquake four times and killed the entirety of his team, I don't know what to do, so I'ma just talk shit. Mamma Swan, get in that Magirna ass! Let's go! Beat that ass! Who's coming out next? Who is it? Bring him out! Show me my opponent! Low Bunny, you can't outspeed me with the sticky web up! I'm Jolly! Saint Nick! Earthquake that bitch! Let's go! Yes! Beat his ass! Earthquake! Yes! Who's next? Show me my next opponent! Who is it? Get all these rifts! Get all these tectonic plates! Get all these tremors, all these aftershocks. Weavile, max HP, it doesn't matter. I'm too powerful. I don't even need Stealth Rocks to kill you. I have a life orb. Catch this earthquake, you're dead, you're frail. What even are you? You're not a weasel. What is a Weavile anyways? Get out of here. You're dead from 100%. Oh my goodness. How can you protect your family, your kids, your brothers, your sisters with that kind of defense stat? Heatran, I forgot about you. You took about 80% from my chandelier earlier. You're still here? How? Catch this earthquake. You're dead. I'm done. There's nothing else for me to say. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I didn't know what to say. There was about a minute left in the battle. I had to say something. I can't just stay silent and watch you guys watch me click earthquake like damn i'm sorry jesus anyways thank you guys for watching <laughs> i low-key went uh pokemon rose there that's basically what i would say if i seen some of these pokemon there anyways hit that like button comment subscribe if you guys enjoyed i'll be back tomorrow with a vgc battle i believe might be streaming tonight might not i don't know we'll see bye <laughs>